As I'm going through my comments in my post, I'm seeing that the Trump fucks are coming out in full force. They aren't talking as strongly as they once did. They'll say stuff like, oh, you're old, you're dumb. One guy even said to me, I bet you wouldn't say that to my face. <laughs> I'll bet you. Soon as you get parole, come on down and I'd be happy to fucking say it to your face. You know, the fact of the matter is, is when I run into Trump LaFox now, the last one I talked to, he was spewing conspiracy theories and all this stuff. And I just looked at him and I said, you know, you're just too stupid to converse with. You can't comprehend truth or facts. I'm not going to waste my time. <laughs> he said, you're just afraid of the facts. I said, I know the facts. You just can't understand the facts. So we can't have a real conversation. This is what's going to happen as we get closer to Donald Trump's demise. People are seeing things, the writings on the wall that show that Donald Trump's not going to get out of criminal convictions. They are going to take all his money and they don't know what to do. They're too arrogant, too stupid to back off and say, you know, I was wrong. They're going to double down and triple down and they're going to go off the cliff with Donald Trump. So keep the Trump fucks coming to my page because every time you do, I just fucking block you. It's a very easy process, and you help me with picking out who are the dumb fucks and who aren't. There are plenty of you out there, but your retorts and your attacks are getting so much weaker. I don't know if you're dumber or you're scared or a combination of both, but you're losing. No matter what you say to me, no matter what you think, you're losing every day. Even Fox News is telling you you're losing. So deal with that, motherfuckers. Today, Donald Trump is probably bathing in the glory of his big win in the Supreme Court. It's going to be another good day, too. It's Super Tuesday. He might very well win 16 primaries in one friggin' day. He might even lock up the nomination for the Republican Party. Oh, these are good days for Donald Trump. Except one thing. Donald Trump has four days to come up with $83.3 million in the E. Jean Carroll case. Four days is all he's got to get that money together. And it's sure looking like Donald Trump's having trouble scraping together money. He's trying to delay things, cut deals, but to no avail. So what happens is he needs to post a bond for $83.3 million. If he does that, he'll get an appeal. Everything will sit steady for a bit as the appeal goes on. Of course, he'll lose the appeal, then he'll lose the money. But the bottom line is the money has to come out of his pocket by this weekend. And if it doesn't, Eugene Carroll's lawyer then gets to go to the judge and say, well, Donnie didn't do it. Let's start season properties. And that's exactly what's going to fucking happen next week. People always say nothing ever happens to Donald Trump. Well, shit's happening now, and next week's about to get ugly. And that's just the appetizer, because in a couple weeks after that, he's going to need to come up with a half a fucking billion. Oh, enjoy these days, these small wins, Donnie, because the rest of your life is totally fucked.